I'm gonna do a really easy uh, a poof, front poof, and uh, like an easy side braid. And I'm just gonna put a little different spin on the side braid, and hopefully it turns out okay. <laughs> okay. So just section off your what you want for your poof. I'm gonna make this kind of a bigger poof today. And so I'm gonna go like the sides of my forehead here, and about halfway back of my head. And now my hair is um, a little dirtier than the other video that I did the other day, where it was too clean. This is the same hair, so now we're going on third day here. Okay, and then I'll have to wash. Okay, so just tease the back just a little bit. Okay, and then you can put a little hairspray in the front and the back if you want to, or you can. I don't want to. Okay, so now I'm going to grab this, pull it back, give it, pull it back pretty tight, a little twist, and then push forward. Okay, and the higher you want that, then the more you push it. Okay, and so then we're going to do. Um, these aren't in my teeth, they're just kind of shooting her. Okay, so what I did is anchored that going from back to front and set it sideways like this. I just went like this forward. And I'm going to do the other side, and you can do two or three depending on how secure it feels. So I'm going to go on the other side from the outside and then in, and then give it a little twist, and then uh, forward. Okay, and then it, this time it probably can use one more. So I'm going to try to join kind of the two of those together right there where they are and then add this third one okay so that's pretty secure and then if you need to you can spray it again that's probably good though it's going anywhere okay so now we're going to kind of do like the holding on to that bump so it doesn't come around I'm going to try to get some of this frizzies come down okay to the side and then we're just going to do a um, Yeah, I'm going to hold it up at the top first um, with this one. Okay. Okay. And then if you want a little poof in the back or a little bump, just grab right from the crown with your fingers or you can use a comb or something if you can do it better with that. But I just grab right here, pull it out up. If you can see that, and then I'll have to tighten this back and spray that. Let's see how that turned out. Hopefully, it turned out okay. Let's see. I think it's okay. Okay, so now we're going to do a half of a braid. Just a regular braid. Try to get it even. And we're going to do half of it down. I never bring everything I need in here when I do this. <laughs> I'll have to pause it in a minute. But okay, so I'm going to go like halfway down here and I'm going to uh, put this around it. Okay, then I'll pause it and go get find another one because I didn't bring it with me. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start pulling the outsides of this one. Um, I think I'm going to just put a shirt under as you can see because my hair is so dark. You can kind of see what I'm doing. Okay, so start pulling and kind of hold your ponytail if you need to just on the outside of it, not the whole thing. See how it kind of poofs it out and just I'm grabbing right here. I'm not grabbing this whole thing. I'm grabbing like right here, pulling out. Okay, and then find the top one. I think this is it. Pull out, out, out. That's pretty even, I think. Okay, and then go ahead and braid and down some more as far as you want. This one is not going to be quite as big, but we're still going to try to make it kind of big. 
Should look fun. Just, just, I'm just briding. Just grab and bride. And then leave some because you don't want to do it all. You want to have some ends there. Okay. And I couldn't find out. I've got mismatched ones in my hair. <laughs> one's brown, two are black. But it's just to show you kind of what I'm doing. Okay. And these aren't even the right things. There's a headband I just put in there. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to do that same thing. I'm going to pull the outsides and kind of hold your base and you might slide it down a little if you need to. So we're just kind of, hold on, let me scoot this down just a little bit. Okay. So pull and it's going to kind of pull up the ends too. It's okay. Pull on the outside only. If you need to, scoot that down. Pull, pull, oops. That one kind of pulled only in one spot. Pull. Okay. Then just kind of pull that back. So you kind of just have a funky double braid. Oops. You might have to redo this because I just pulled it right out. But that's okay. At least I got it done and then we can put it where we want it after we get it all pulled. And you can kind of hold it and do it that way and then put that in. And that's okay too, however. See, it only turned into like a couple of chunks and we had all that there braided. Then you can put it up there where you want it. This is not the prettiest uh, holder because <laughs> it's not what it is. Okay, and then you can just kind of do whatever you want to to your ends. You could curl them or whatever. I don't know if you can kind of see how this turned out. Let's see if I can show you. So this is kind of what it looks like and then you can mess with this and get it bigger if you want to but this is kind of what it looks like. Anyway, it's nothing fancy. It's just simple and this would have worked better if I had a particular holder here. So that's it anyway. And then you can do whatever you want to with your ends. I just kind of put like back combed it like one time just then because it's kind of looks thinner where I did all this thick. You could curl them if you want to. But anyway, that's it. It's just something simple and casual. So you, hopefully you can see it. So a poof, a side ponytail, double braid, and pull on the ends.